Welcome back, yogis, to New Year, New Yogi. Today we are on day 11. Can you believe we've made it this far? So today and tomorrow on day 12, we're going to be sewing together some of the flows and sequences we've already worked on. So everything will look really familiar to you and hopefully you'll be able to progress your practice. My name is Jewel with Become Yoga School. Let's start seated in a crisscross style Sukhasana. You could also take half or full lotus. You could hop up on a block like me, or you could seat yourself right onto the mat. Bring your hands into heart and center. Close your eyes. Keep a moment here. And remember that this 12 minute practice is your you time. So invite the opportunity to let go of taking care of others, creating a choose list. Elbows together, lift the heart, eagle wrapped arms, inhale, cow with eagle wrapped, inhale, cat with eagle wrapped, inhale, cow, hug the abs tight, exhale, cat, one more round, inhale, cow, seated, exhale, cat, seated, come back to neutral, seated in center, reach your arms beside you, lift and twist to your right, exhale, come to sit, one time, inhale, lift and twist, cat, Exhale back to center. Spread your feet wide and then crisscross the other way. Other foot in front or on top. Let the knees drop down lower than your hips. Inhale, reach hands high. As you exhale, twist to your left this time. Right arm across the thigh. Use the back palm to twist your back. Move your chin toward that left shoulder. Eyes loosen. Fingers strong. Raise your left arm above the ear, side bend it over to your right as if you could go, go gadget this arm all the way to your knee joint. Breathe in, up at the elbow or hand. Opening up the throat chakra where we have our voices. Excellent. Round this arm toward the knee. Flip the palms, physically grab the knees or thighs. Kiss the elbows together, wrap the arms again. Cow, cow. Inhale, opening the heart chakra, exhale, round the spine, opening the back ribs. One more time, inhale, lift, exhale, curl. Squeeze the abs, come up to center, unfold the arms, big twist to your left. Exhale, come back to center, big twist to your right. Amazing, back to center. We're gonna take cat and cow on our hands and knees. So come onto all fours if you have blocks like me. You're simply gonna place these blocks beside you now. Palms on the mat, knees underneath your hips. Start with cow. Squeeze elbows in, lift the heart, lift the gaze, cow pose. Round your spine, cat pose. Inhale, arch the spine. Exhale, round the spine. One more inhale, this is our back bend. And exhale, this is our forward bend. Lovely. Come into a neutral stance. Draw shoulder blades together. Tuck your toes. Stay here for five second hold. Lift the knees and balance for five, four. Get nice and warm. Three, two. Take down dog. Lift the hips if you need to walk feet back or hands forward to let this fit you. Go right ahead. How about a five breath down dog? Remember how it felt 11 days ago to hold a five breath down dog? Does it feel easier to slide into now? One more breath in. 
tiptoe your feet forward one at a time till you're at the top of the mat. Excellent. Shake your head no. Shake your head yes. Heel toe the feet to touch if they are not yet there. Squeeze your abs. Inhale, half lift, look forward. Exhale, release the head, drop down. Circle the arms, come all the way to stand. Squeeze the glutes, bring your hands to your heart. Tap back into that intention. Breathe. Breathe out. Fantastic. Inhale, reach your hands up. Exhale, forward, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders pull back. Step your right leg back, low lunge. Step your left leg back, plank. Shift forward from plank. Drop the knees, the chest, the chin. Slither forward. Cobra or up dog is where you'll go next. Down dog after that. Lift your right leg in the air. Knee to nose one time. Step that foot forward. Perch pose. Pick up that back foot. Kick your bum. Remember her. Drop your feet down to touch again. Inhale, half lift. Reverse swan dive to stand. Hands to heart center. Good. Inhale, reach hands up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, left leg. Step it back. Excellent. Squeeze the palms down. Plank. Inhale, shift. Chaturanga, 90 degrees. Lift the heart. Upward facing dog if it's there. Downward facing dog. Lift left leg in the sky, think knee to nose, shift, step it forward, and then keep going forward, fingers down, foot up, release the foot. Inhale, half lift, exhale, release. Reverse swan dive to stand, hands to arms and work. Inhale, sit to chair, hips go back, hands go low, wrap your front roots in, drop your hips down and Utanasana, standing forward fold. Inhale, Ardha Utanasana. Exhale, release the palms. Right leg, low lunge. Left leg, down dog splits. Knee to nose, three times. Shift forward, one, and send it back. Shift forward, two, send it back. Shift forward, three, step on that foot. Turn in the right heel, warrior one. Inhale, sweep arms up. There go my blocks. Draw your abs in, inner thighs strong. Bending through the front knee. This is gonna go to perch. Your hands have to help you out. Look where you wanna go. Breathe in, fingers to the mat, kick your bum. Boop, release the foot. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, release. Look through the knees. Circle the arms, come up to Tadasana. Hands to heart center. Sit your hips low, three breath chair. Tailbone goes low, ribs draw in. We breathe clearly three times. Raise the eyes if you feel heavy. Shift the weight into the heels. Excellent. Forward fold. Inhale, half lift the core. Step your left leg back, low lunge. Plant the palms, down dog split. The right leg sweeps high. Knee to nose three times. Shift forward, one. Send it back. Squeeze triceps in. Send it back. Third one, hover. Step the foot forward, spin in the back heel. Warrior one, Zero Bhadrasana one. And yes, the more we continue, the more you'll remember the Sanskrit terms, no worries. Left hip forward, right hip backward, belly under. Take it to perch in a breath. Exhale, go. Fingers, toes, boop. Release the foot. Inhale, half lift. That was good. Exhale, release. Reverse swan dive to stand. Excellent, hands under. Step your right leg back about two feet. Correct, spin it toward me. Hello, friend, reach your arms east and left. Exhale, forward fold over your legs. Woo. In this forward fold, take any bind you like. Yogi toe lock, grab the ankles, reverse prayer, fully clasped hands. Go for a headstand if you're feeling it. We're gonna do a warrior two on each side. Circle the arms all the way up to stand. 
Excellent. Keep your left leg as it is. Lift your right toes, open it up. Warrior two. For most people, this will fit perfectly. If it didn't, you could shift this foot a little bit. You do not need to settle for anything less than perfect for you. Five breaths. Inhale one, Virabhadrasana two. So that warrior one faces forward, warrior two faces sideways. Both have the same energy, like a warrior. See where you want to go. What would you like to conquer? One more breath in. As you exhale, take a reverse or peaceful warrior, and then take a side angle variation. Elbow to knee, hand to floor, arm overhead, half bind, full bind. We're only here for a couple breaths, so find what fits you now. Breathe in. Keep this left arm overhead. Squeeze the obliques. Reach your right arm. Squeeze it. Lift it. Open it, warrior two. Lengthen the leg. Toes come forward. Take it to your other side. Turn out your left thigh. Adjust as necessary. Hips under shoulders. Yeah. Bend the front knee. Reach your arms east and west. Five breaths, warrior two. It's okay if you settle into this. Your first breath may not look like your fifth breath. We're always looking for that progression. Inhale, five, stick the legs, reach back, reverse warrior. Side angle, same choice, elbow to knee, hand to block or mat, arm overhead. Look up at that top elbow, pull the shoulder blades back, tone, tone, tone the obliques, and then bend, bend, bend that front knee. Yeah, really smart listen. Keep this top arm overhead. Look forward, add your left arm, squeeze the obliques, come up. Open it, warrior two. Lengthen the leg, reach toes forward, listen, different stuff. Exhale, forward fold, and then tuck one knee underneath the other. Take a moment of reflection here. Maybe 10 days ago you have never done warrior one or two. Maybe you've been doing yoga for a decade but you never tried perch pose. Maybe fluidly moving from movement to movement has been a goal of yours and maybe you've progressed in that manner. Just let yourself know on day 11, what's your story? And then supportively press one palm down, bring yourself up, come back to a kneeling or seated position. Whatever works for you. Also works for me, bring your hands into your heart center. Did wonderfully today. Tomorrow will look a little bit like today, but might even move more quickly. So wonderfully, wonderfully done. Take a deep breath in as a team, and as you exhale, take a forward bow.